So I'm making myself a birthday cake, and I'm making it a gluten-free, sugar-free cake, man, with vanilla and chocolate ganache. Gluten-free flour. One tablespoon baking powder. I'm gonna use Boca Sweet, the Kamboka Squash Sugar Alternative. This stuff is awesome, no calories, and it's good for you too, it's a health food. So I'm blending in a teaspoon of salt, and there's three eggs and a cup of milk. And I'm blending in butter. This is a birthday cake. How about some sour cream and vanilla? Mm -mm. Now I'm going to blend in this gluten-free flour mix and can book a swash. And add my liquid ingredients to that. Blend it until it's nice and smooth. It's going to look a little thinner than you're used to. In every gluten-free recipe, you need to let this rest for like an hour. The flours hydrate in an hour. If you do it right away, you screw it up. Let it rest, it's gonna thicken up. Okay, I'm pouring it in a pan. I'm gonna bake it in a 325 degree oven, nice and slow, long and slow, an hour and a half. Look at that. Now I'm gonna make a white chocolate ganache. Very simple, I like it simple today. This is monk fruit white chocolate chips by Chalk Zero. This stuff is dynamite. Now I'm blending that with a little heavy cream and I'm gonna put in some cream cheese. This is so good. This is a cream cheese white chocolate ganache with no sugar. Oh my God, look at that. These are colorful stevia sprinkles, no sugar. Happy birthday. I'm serving this with my monk fruit cashew chocolate ice cream that I made. That's another recipe. Oh. Happy birthday.